My grandfather passed away last October, and I learned so much from him. First, let me mention that my grandfather was a big man, not obese, but big of stature. We called him Big Daddy. <laughs> when he would shake my hands, his hand would literally wrap around mine. My Big Daddy's hands were tough. He was a brick mason. He carried bricks and worked with his hands all of his life. He even built his own house with his own hands. As a kid, I remember working with him in the hot sun, laying bricks, and I hated it. I remember thinking there must be a better way. So I decided to exert the same energy with my mind that Big Daddy displayed with his hands. I took my grandfather's work ethic and I applied it to the business world. My grandfather was a provider. I also learned leadership from my grandfather. He was a cornerstone, family pillar, unmovable, protector, nothing to play with. <laughs> Don't get me started about my big mama. He was a leader, he was a man of integrity. He provided direction and guidance. Big Daddy was also present. He spent time with his family and with me, not accidentally, but intentionally. We felt his presence and his love and we gained life lessons. Just like Big Daddy, there are men all over the world that put their families first. I wanna commend you today. I wanna to commend you as a provider. I wanna encourage you as a leader. And I wanna thank you for your presence. Your family is an extension of your legacy. And just like Big Daddy, you will impact future generations to come. Continue to be a leader, continue to be a provider, and continue to be present. Happy Father's Day to, to Big Daddy, and happy Father's Day to my pops, and a happy Father's Day to all you fathers. Please tag someone in this video that you love and that you appreciate. Peace.